What happens when your dog is choking? The thing you want to look out for, if there is going to be choking, and that very small percentage of the time, an object is lodged somewhere that is cutting off the air. And the first thing you're going to notice is the dog is going to go unconscious. The best thing to do is try to reach in with your finger and pull it out as fast as you can. So the other way to do that, if you have to do a Heimlich maneuver, it's difficult to do. Uh, for an untrained person, but the best thing to do is to hold the little doggy. So I'm gonna put you on the lap, and I'm basically just gonna apply pressure behind the rib cage, right here, and just push down to create uh, air pushing forward, pressure forward, to try to get that out of there. I'm not gonna do it now, it's gonna hurt him. Yeah. But if I do it like that, a little bit, you might be able oh, to hear I some heard air. That. Yeah. Okay. This is another trick we do if they have a reverse sneeze. You hear that, like, some dogs will do this. I think that he means, likes it. That means that their uh, epiglottis is stuck back there with the palate. So you can actually go like this, apply pressure, and stop that thing. It'll pop out. That's kind of like the Heimlich maneuver. But again, extremely rare. And if, you, if that happens and there's something in there, try to get it out first. And then you can try to either do it with a small dog, you can just press behind the rib cage here to create pressure to pop it out.